After the failed G7 summit, U.S. President Trump criticized Canadian PM Justin Trudeau in a tweet, calling him dishonest and weak. A White House official then accused Trudeau of stabbing the U.S. in the back. While not calling out Trudeau by name, the official said there is a special place in hell for any foreign leader that engages in bad faith diplomacy with Trump. All of this came as quite a shock. The U.S. is the leader of the West in the past. This leader was determined by the amount spent on public affairs such as NATO and willingness to make small concessions when conflicts of interest arose. Those small concessions have gotten U.S. leadership great buttons and the country has profited greatly from them. Now the Trump administration is asking its Western allies to settle up and has no scruples about turning on those allies to get it. The U.S. from now on not only wants to make strategic gains, but also to clearly separate business and family and get whatever it can, no matter how small it is. Trump seems to be cashing in on the U.S.'s leadership. He truly is transforming America.